Welcome to Canadian Family Official Channel. If you are new this channel please subscribe like and press bell button for more videos. When you done your test please share your experience in comments. Pass first time G1 practice test. Rules and regulations. When driving a motor vehicle on the highway at night you should use low beam headlight, dim lights, when? Number 1 meeting or following another vehicle? Number 2 blinded by the headlights of an approaching vehicle? Number 3 approaching an intersection? Number 4 another driver dims his lights. And the answer is meeting or following another vehicle? Before leaving your car parked on a downgrade, you should Number 1 Turn your front wheel to the left and set your parking brake Number 2 Set your parking brake only Number 3 Leave your front wheels parallel to the curb Number 4 Turn your front wheels to the right and set your parking brake and the answer is turn your front wheels to the right and set your parking brake. If you have G1 or G2 license and you are driving under influence of alcohol, number one, you will be called for an interview. Number two, your license will be cancelled. Number three, you will receive a warning letter. Number four, your license will be suspended for 30 days and you may be charged under criminal code. And the answer is your license will be suspended for 30 days and you may be charged under criminal code. If you have G1 or G2 license what is the maximum level of blood alcohol? Number 10% Number 20.05% Number 30.08% Number 40.5% And the answer is 0%. When on the streets designed for two-way traffic, hear the siren of an emergency vehicle, what does the law require you to do? Number 1. Pull to the right and stop. Number 2. Speed up to get out of the way. Number 3. Slow down to 15 kilometers, 10 miles, an hour. Number 4. Continue at the same speed. And the answer is pull to the right and stop. When a school bus stops with red signals flashing the law requires drivers of other vehicles to Number 1. Reduce speed and pass with added care. Number 2. Does not matter provided you sound horn. Number 3. Wait for approaching vehicles to pass. Number 4. Stop until the bus proceeds or the signal lights are no longer operating? And the answer is stop until the bus proceeds or the signal lights are no longer operating? If you first convicted criminally for how long your license could be suspended? Number 1. One year. Number 2. Two year. Number 3. Three year. Number 4 5 year. And the answer is 1 year. If you refuse to give breathalyzer test or blood test or you have more than allowed alcohol in your blood or breath, then for how long your license could be suspended right way? Number 1 90 days. Number 2 120 days. Number 3 160 days. Number 4 180 days. And the answer is 90 days. The broken center line on a roadway means you may. Number 1 never pass. Number 2 pass if the way is clear. Number 3 pass at any time. Number 4 pass only during daylight hours. And the answer is pass if the way is clear. If a traffic signal changes while a pedestrian is still in the intersection, which of the following has the right of way? Number 1. Motorists making turns. Number 2. Motorists coming from the left. Number 3. Motorists coming from the right. Number 4. The pedestrian.
And the answer is the pedestrian. When approaching an intersection where a stop sign faces you, what does the law require you to do? Number one, stop and then proceed. Number two, stop and proceed when it is safe to do so. Number three, slow down and proceed when it is safe to do so. Number four, yield right of way if necessary to vehicles approaching from the left or right. And the answer is stop and proceed when it is safe to do so. When you are approaching the spot designated for streetcar to take on or discharge passengers, what you supposed to do? Number one, if you are not driving in on one-way street, you could go past from right side by driving very carefully at moderate speed and keeping in mind of pedestrians. Number two, never pass that streetcar. Number three, I you are not driving in on one-way street, you could pass from right side. Number four, blow the horn and pass the streetcar. And the answer is, if you are not driving in on one-way street, you could go pass from right side by driving very carefully at moderate speed and keeping in mind of pedestrians. If you waiting in intersection to make left-hand turn lights turns red, what you should do? Number one, you should wait there because light is red. Number two, back up your car. Number three, go straight but do not make a left turn. Number four, make the left turn when it is safe to do. And the answer is you should wait there because light is red. Upon approaching an intersection marked with a yield sign, you are required to. Number one, keep same speed and look left and right. Number two, stop and then enter the intersection quickly. Number three, stop and then enter the intersection slowly. Number four, enter intersection only when way is clear. And the answer is enter intersection only when way is clear. The traffic signal is not working and there is no body to direct the traffic what you supposed to do? Number one, stop and go straight. Number two, treat it like always stop sign. Number three, before you pass, check your left and right. Number four, blow the horn and go straight. And the answer is treat it like always stop sign. If you are neither passing somebody nor making a left turn, where you should drive your vehicle? Number one, middle of the roadways. Number two, always drive on right side. Number three, always drive on left side. Number four, drive wherever you want to drive. And the answer is always drive on right side. When driving in heavy fog, you should use number one, low beam headlights, number two, parking lights, number three, parking lights and high beam headlights, number four, high beam headlights. And the answer is low beam headlights. Which of the following hand and arm signals is correct for slowing or stopping? Number one, arm straight out of the window. Number two, arm out and up. Number three, arm out and down. Number four, circle motion. And the answer is arm out and down. If you have G1 license at what time you are not supposed to drive? Number one, half an hour after sunrise and half an hour before sunset. Number two, from midnight till 5 a.m. Number three in the bad weather when visibility is poor. Number four in rush hours. And the answer is from midnight till 5 a.m. If you have G1 license, you could only drive on 400 series highway or any road where speed is more 80 kilometers, HR. Number one, you have a certified driving instructor with you. Number two driver with four years driving license.
Number three, when carefully you could enter highway. Number four, when you get make experience. And the answer is you have a certified driving instructor with you. Should your right wheels drop off the roadway, what is the best way to get back in the roadway? Number one, apply brakes to reduce speed. Number two, steer hard to the left. Number three, apply brakes and steer hard to the left. Number four, take foot off gas pedal. Turn back when vehicle has slowed. And the answer is take foot off gas pedal. Turn back when vehicle has slowed. When there is cyclist in your lane you should? Number one, blow the horn and pass. Number two, pass the cyclist in same lane. Number three, wait for the cyclist, give the way then pass him. Number four, check in mirrors, signal. Check the blind spot. If it is safe, make the lane change and pass the cyclist. And the answer is check in mirrors, signal, check the blind spot. If it is safe, make the lane change and pass the cyclist. To avoid the collision, you should. Number one, always keep your headlights on. Number two, do not drive in busy traffic. Number three, keep more space in left right, front and back of your vehicle and try to adjust your speed accordingly. Number four, don't drive in bad weather. And the answer is keep more space in left, right, front and back of your vehicle and try to adjust your speed accordingly. Except when you tend to overtake and pass another vehicle or when you intend to make a left turn, you should. Number one, drive in the center of the roadway. Number two, always keep well to the right. Number three, drive on the shoulder of the highway. Number four, always keep well to the left. And the answer is always keep well to the right. Which of the following has the right of way over all others at an intersection when the signal light is green? Number one, pedestrians crossing with the light. Number two, vehicles turning right. Number three, pedestrians crossing against the light. Number four, vehicles turning left. And the answer is pedestrians crossing with the light. If you have G1 license, most important thing is that you should. Number one, drive alone so that you won't get distracts. Number two, you must have driver with you at least four year driving experience. Number three, hold the steering wheel with both hands. Number four, drive only day timeless turning left. And the answer is you must have driver with you at least four year driving experience. The driver sitting beside the G1 driver must have blood alcohol concentration less than. Number 1 0.05%. Number 2 0.1%. Number 3 0.5%. Number 4 0.08%. And the answer is 0.05%. You should under all conditions drive at a speed which will allow you to. Number 1 stop within 90 meters, 300 feet. Number 2 stop within 60 meters, 200 feet. Number 3 stop within 150 meters, 500 feet. Number 4 stop within a safe distance. And the answer is stop within a safe distance. If you have G1 license, the driver setting beside you should be Number one, owner of the vehicle. Number two, be your relative or friend. Number three, must sit on the front seat alone. Number four, must have done defensive driving course. And the answer is must sit on the front seat alone. To change license from G1 to G2, what someone should do? Number one, pass the written test. 
4G2. Number 2 Don't do anything. After required time you will get G2 license by mail. Number 3 Complete defensive driving course. Number 4 After waiting the required time, pass the G1 exist test. And the answer is after waiting the required time, pass the G1 exist test. When entering a freeway, you should signal, then. Number 1 Stop on acceleration lane, wait for an opening, and then enter the freeway rapidly. Number 2 Slow down and then enter freeway at a sharp angle. Number 3 Drive slowly and be prepared to stop for freeway traffic. Number 4 Accelerate quickly to freeway speed and merge with freeway traffic. And the answer is accelerate quickly to freeway speed and merge with freeway traffic. Unless otherwise posted, the maximum speed limit on highway outside a city, town, village, or built-up area is Number 1 100 km, 60 miles per hour Number 2 80 km, 50 miles per hour Number 3 60 km, 35 miles per hour Number 4 90 km, 55 miles per hour And the answer is 80 km, 50 miles per hour if you have a G2 license you should. Number 1. Your blood alcohol concentration should be 0%. You can carry only as many a passengers, as many working seat belts. Number 2. You should not drive from midnight to 5 a.m. Number 3. Not drive on 400 series highway. Number 4. Drive anywhere anytime you don't have any restrictions. And the answer is your blood alcohol concentration should be 0%. You can carry only as many a passengers, as many working seat belts. If there is motorcycle in you lane you should. Number 1. Check mirror and blind spot. Give the signal. If safe then make the lane change. Number 2. Keep driving in same lane. Number 3. Keep behind the motorcyclist so that motorcyclist will know that you are there. Number 4. Blow the horn and ask the motorcycle to give away. And the answer is check mirror and blind spot, give the signal, if safe then make the lane change. To get your vehicle out of skid, you should first. Number 1. Steer straight ahead. Number 2. Steer in the direction of the skid. Number 3. Steer in the opposite direction of the skid. Number 4. Apply brake hard. And the answer is steer in the direction of the skid. If there is motorcycle on the road you should extra careful because. Number 1. Motorcycles are very expensive. Number 2 Motorcycles is smaller in size that is why sometimes it is hard to see and it's as hard to estimate its speed. Number 3 Motorcycles is not any danger to the car. Number 4 It is motorcyclist responsibility to be more careful. And the answer is Motorcycles is smaller in size that is why sometimes it is hard to see and it's as hard to estimate its speed. If you are driving more than 50 kilometers over the posted speed limit or you charged with careless driving you could face. Number 1 Fine Number 2 Suspension Number 3 Demerit Points Number 4 Demerit Points Fine Suspension And the answer is Demerit Points Fine Suspension at an intersection where there is a flashing amber, yellow, traffic light, you must. Number 1. Stop if making right turn. Number 2. Continue at same speed. Number 3. Stop if making left turn. Number 4. Slow down and proceed with caution. And the answer is slow down and proceed with caution. When lights are required, 
Drivers must use lower beam headlights when following another vehicle. Number one within 30 meters, 100 feet. Number two within 60 meters, 200 feet. Number three within 120 meters, 400 feet. Number four, this only applies when approaching another vehicle. And the answer is within 60 meters, 200 feet. When lights are required, drivers are required to use low beam headlights. Number one within one kilometer, 0 0.6 miles of the approach of another vehicle. Number two within 150 meters, 500 feet of the approach of another vehicle. Number 3 within 300 meters, 100 feet of the approach of another vehicle. Number 4 this is a safety practice, not a law. And the answer is within 150 meters, 500 feet of the approach of another vehicle. Unless otherwise posted, the maximum speed limit allowed in the city, town, village and built-up area is Number 130 kilometers, 20 miles per hour. Number 250 kilometers, 30 miles per hour. Number 340 kilometers, 25 miles per hour. Number 460 kilometers, 35 miles per hour. And the answer is 50 kilometers, 30 miles per hour. If your license gets suspended under what circumstance you could still drive? Number one, if you think you are a very skilled driver. Number two, daytime only. Number three, just to back and forth to work only. Number four, you cannot drive at all. And the answer is you cannot drive at all. If you have G1 or G2 license, after how many demerit points your license could be suspended? Number 1, 4 demerit points. Number 2, 6 demerit points. Number 3, 8 demerit points. Number 4, during first two year, 9 or more demerit points. And the answer is during first two year, 9 or more demerit points. When the traffic signal light facing you is red and you intend to go straight through the intersection, what must you do? Number one stop, give pedestrian the right of way, then proceeds with caution. Number two stop, proceed when the way is clear. Number three slow down, proceed when the way is clear. Number four stop, proceed only when the signal turns green and when the way is clear. And the answer is stop, proceed only when the signal turns green and when the way is clear. On a roadway where traffic is moving in both directions, in what position must you before making a left turn? Number one close to the right-hand side of the roadway. Number two close to the left-hand side of the roadway. Number three immediately to the right of the center line of the roadway. Number four does not matter provided you signal. And the answer is immediately to the right of the center line of the roadway. While traveling on a highway, the driver of a motor vehicle is not permitted to carry in a house or boat trailer. Number one, firearms. Number two, flammable material. Number three, persons. Number four, pets? And the answer is persons. When a streetcar is stopped to take on or discharge passengers, or there is no safety zone, what does the law require you to do before passing the streetcar? Number one, stop behind the rear of the streetcar and then proceed. Number two, sound horn and pass with caution. Number three, pass on the left side when the way is clear. Number four, stop two meters, six feet behind the rearmost door where passengers are getting on or off and proceed only when it is safe to do so.
and the answer is stop 2 meters 6 feet behind the rearmost door where passengers are getting on or off, and proceed only when it is safe to do so? If you have G1 or G2 license and you have accumulated maximum allowable demerit points, for how long your license will be suspended? Number 1 30 days. Number 2 60 days. Number 3 90 days. Number 4 120 days. And the answer is 60 days. If the transit bus driver is giving signal to you leave after picking and dropping the passengers you should. Number 1 speed up and pass the bus. Number 2 blow the horn and pass the bus. Number 3 stop or slow down and let the bus to go. Number 4 don't pay any attention to the bus. And the answer is stop or slow down and let the bus to go. A flashing red signal light at an intersection means Number 1 slow down and drive with increased caution Number 2 slow down and if necessary yield right of way to cars approaching from the left or right Number 3 signal light is out of order proceed with caution Number 4 stop proceed only when it is safe to do so And the answer is stop Proceed only when it is safe to do so? When a right turn against a red signal light is permitted, what does the law require you to do before entering the intersection and making the turn? Number 1. Slow down, proceed with caution. Number 2. Stop, and then merge into traffic. Number 3. Stop. Signal makes the turn so as not to interfere with other traffic, including pedestrians. Number 4. Slow down, signal and turn. And the answer is stop. Signal makes the turn so as not to interfere with other traffic, including pedestrians. A flashing blue light mounted on a motor vehicle indicates. Number 1. Motor vehicle carrying explosives. Number 2. Snow removal equipment. Number 3. An ambulance. Number 4. A police emergency vehicle. And the answer is snow removal equipment. If you are involved in an accident in which someone is injured you must. Number 1. Report the accident at once to the nearest provincial or municipal police office. Number 2. Report the accident within 48 hours to the nearest provincial or municipal police office. Number 3. Report the accident to you insurance company only. Number 4. Report the accident to the Ministry of Transportation and Communications only. And the answer is report the accident at once to the nearest provincial or municipal police office. How close to a fire hydrant may you legally park? Number 1 1.5 meters, 5 feet. Number 2 6 meters, 20 feet. Number 3 4.5 meters, 15 feet. Number 4 3 meters, 10 feet. And the answer is 3 meters, 10 feet. You can be charged with dangerous or careless driving if you Number 1. Make sudden lane change on the highway Number 2. Forget put you signal Number 3. Do not wear you seatbelt Number 4. Cause a collision while using cellular phone And the answer is cause a collision while using cellular phone when you make a left turn what hand signal is correct? Number 1 arm straight at out of window. Number 2 arm out and up. Number 3 arm out and down. Number 4 circle motion. And the answer is arm straight at out of window. Never change lanes in traffic without. Number 1. Blowing your horn and looking to the rear. 
Number two, looking into the rear view mirror only. Number three, giving proper signal and looking to make sure the move be made safely. Number four, decreasing speed and giving correct signal. And the answer is giving proper signal and looking to make sure the move be made safely. A solid center line on the roadway is on your side of a broken center line. What does the solid line means? Number one, pass at any time. Number two, it is safe to overtake and pass. Number three, pass only when no traffic is in sight. Number four, it is unsafe to overtake and pass. And the answer is it is unsafe to overtake and pass. When a car is stopped to allow a pedestrian to cross the street at a marked crosswalk, you should. Number one, pass the stopped car to the right. Number two, not pass any car stopped to allow a pedestrian to cross. Number three, sound horn for the driver of the stopped car to drive on. Number four, pass the stopped car on the left. And the answer is not pass any car stop to allow a pedestrian to cross. You are required to keep a safe distance behind the vehicle in front of you 50 kilometers, 30 miles, an hour you should keep at least, he stopped car to the right. Number one, five car lengths behind the other vehicle. Number two, one car length behind the other vehicle. Number three, three car length behind the other vehicle. Number four, seven car length behind the other vehicle. And the answer is three car length behind the other vehicle. When approaching an intersection and you notice the roadway behind the intersection is blocked with traffic, you should. Number one, keep as close as possible to the car ahead. Number two, proceed slowly into the intersection until the traffic ahead moves on. Number three, stop before entering the intersection and wait until traffic ahead moves on. Number four, sound horn to warn cars ahead to move on. And the answer is stop before entering the intersection and wait until traffic ahead moves on. When approaching railway crossing at which an electrical or mechanical signal device is warning of approach of a train you must. Number 1. Stop not less than 1.5 meters 15 feet, from the nearest rail. Number 2. Increase speed in cross tracks as quickly as possible. Number 3. Stop not less than 5 meters 15 feet, from the nearest rail. Number four, slow down and proceed with caution. And the answer is stop not less than five meters, 15 feet from the nearest rail. Parking lights may be used. Number one, at any time. Number two, for parking only. Number three, when driving in heavy fog. Number four, when driving on well-lighted street. And the answer is for parking only? When the driver of another vehicle is about to overtake and pass your vehicle you must. Number one, speed up so that passing is not necessary. Number two, signal to other drivers not to pass. Number three, move to the right and allow such vehicle to pass. Number four, move to the left to prevent passing. And the answer is move to the right and allow such vehicle to pass. When you're making a right turn, which of the following hand and arm signal is correct? Number one, arm out and down. Number two, arm out and up. Number three, circle motion. Number four, arm straight out of window. And the answer is arm out and up. When you're making a U-turn the most important things you remember. Number 1. Length of the car. Number 2. Height of the curve. Number 3. Where the car coming. Number 4. Traffic rules.
and the answer is traffic rules. Most automobile skids are the result of number one underinflated tires, number two overinflated tires, number three in snow, number four driving too fast, and the answer is driving too fast. The best way to stop quickly on a wet or icy roadway is to Number 1. Pump the brake until you come to a stop. Number 2. Keep the foot off brake and let compression stop you. Number 3. Put brakes on hard and try to prevent vehicle from skidding. Number 4. Apply brakes the same way you always do. And the answer is pump the brake until you come to a stop. Under which of the following conditions is it dangerous and unlawful to make you turn? Number 1. Upon a curve or on a hill where there is a clear view of less than 150 meters 500 feet in either direction. Number 2. On a railway crossing or within 30 meters 100 feet of a railway crossing. Number 3. Within 150 meters 500 feet of a bridge viaduct or tunnel if driver's view is obstructed? Number 4. All of the above. And the answer is all of the above. Before moving your car from a parked position, you should Number 1. Signal and pull from curb. Number 2. Sound your horn and pull from curb slowly. Number 3. Check other traffic, signal, and pull from curb quickly. Number 4. Check other traffic, signal, and pull from curb when it is safe to do so. And the answer is check other traffic, signal, and pull from curb when it is safe to do so. When a truck becomes a disabled on the highway, where the speed limit is in excess of 60 km per hour flares or reflections must be placed approximately what distance ahead of and to the rear of the disabled vehicle. Number 1 15 meters 50 feet. Number 2 30 meters 100 feet. Number 3 60 meters 200 feet. Number 4 90 meters 300 feet. And the answer is 30 meters, 100 feet. Except when passing, what distance must be maintained between commercial vehicles traveling in the same direction on the highway outside a city town or village? Number 1, 30 meters, 100 feet. Number 2, 60 meters, 200 feet. Number 3, 120 meters, 400 feet. Number 4, 150 meters, 500 feet. And the answer is 60 meters, 200 feet. If you are involved in a reportable accident, how soon must you make a report to your nearest provincial or municipal police office? Number 1, within 72 hours. Number 2, within 24 hours. Number 3 within 48 hours. Number 4 at once. And the answer is at once. When approaching a red traffic signal light and a policeman motions you to go through, you must. Number 1 go through at once. Number 2 call the policeman's attention to the red light. Number 3. Stop to make sure the policeman wants you to go through. Number 4. Wait for the light to turn green. And the answer is go through at once. What documents may a police officer require a motor vehicle owner to produce? Number 1. A liability insurance card. Number 2. Ownership. Number 3. A valid driver's license. Number 4. All of the above. And the answer is all of the above. In Ontario, when should you wear seatbelt? Number 1. Only for elderly people or children under 16 years of age. 
Number two, in between business hours only. Number three, always. Number four, never. And the answer is always. When stopped by police at a roadside spot check and asked to provide a breath sample, number one, you can refuse until a lawyer comes. Number two, it is a criminal offense to refuse. Number three, it is a traffic offense to refuse. Number four, you can refuse if you had nothing to drink. And the answer is, it is a criminal offense to refuse. If you are convicted of drinking and driving, you will lose your driver's license on the first offense for number one, one month. Number two, three months. Number three, six months. Number four, one year. And the answer is one year. At what level of alcohol in the blood can you be convicted of being an impaired driver? Number one, zero point zero three percent. Number two, zero point zero five percent. Number three, zero point zero eight percent. Number four, one percent. And the answer is zero point zero eight percent. Every accident must be reported to the police where there is personal injury or when the damage exceeds. Number one, one hundred dollars. Number two, one hundred and fifty dollars. Number three, two hundred dollars. Number four, one thousand dollars. And the answer is one thousand dollars. At night, when you meet another vehicle with blinding bright lights, the safest thing to do is number one, open and shut your eyes rapidly. Number two, look at the headlights of the approaching vehicle. Number three, turn slightly to the right hand side. Number four, look slightly to the right hand side. And the answer is look slightly to the right hand side. In what position on the roadway must you be before making a left turn from a one way traffic street? Number one, close to the right hand side of the roadway. Number two, close to the center line of the roadway. Number three, close to the left side of the roadway. Number four, does not matter provided you signal. And the answer is close to the left side of the roadway. When may you lend your driver's license? Number one, never. Number two, to another person who is learning to drive. Number three, for identification purposes only. Number four, in emergency. And the answer is never. Are cars drivers responsible for their passengers buckling up? Number one, only if passengers are over 16 years of age. Number two, only if passengers are from five years of age up to 16. Number three, only if passengers are in the front seat. Number four, only if passengers are over 18 years of age. And the answer is only if passengers are from five years of age up to 16. How soon after a licensed driver changes his, her name or address is he, she required to notify the Ministry of Transportation and Communications? Number one, within six days. Number two, within 15 days. Number three, within 30 days. Number four, at any time prior to renewal of license. And the answer is within six days. Flashing green light at an intersection where turns to the left and right are permitted, means. Number one, you may turn to the left if the way is clear. Number two, you may turn to the right if the way is clear. Number three, you may proceed straight through if the way is clear. Number four, you may do any of the above. And the answer is you may do any of the above. To what penalties is a driver liable who is convicted of driving while disqualified? Number one, a fine of $500 or imprisonment for six months or both. 
Number 2. Impoundment of the motor vehicle being operated for 3 months. Number 3. An additional 6-month period of suspension of driving privilege. Number 4. Any or all of the above. And the answer is any or all of the above. When it is safe to do so, passing other vehicles on the right sides. Number 1. Is permitted on any street of highway. Number 2 is permitted providing it is possible to do so by driving on the shoulder of the road. Number 3 is not permitted under any circumstances. Number 4 is not permitted when the street or highway has two or more lanes for traffic in the direction you are traveling. And the answer is is not permitted when the street or highway has two or more lanes for traffic in the direction you are traveling. When a red signal light with a green arrow is shown at an intersection it means Number 1. Stop and wait for green light before making turn in the direction of the arrow. Number 2. Proceed with caution in the direction of the arrow yielding right of way to pedestrians and other traffic. Number 3. Stop and then proceed. Number 4. The green arrow is a signal for pedestrians only. And the answer is proceed with caution in the direction of the arrow yielding right of way to pedestrians and other traffic. When may a driver make a left turn on a red light? Number 1. When the way is clear. Number 2. On any red light. Number 3. From a one-way street into a one when the way is clear and the vehicle has brought to a full stop. Number 4. From a two-way street into a two-way street when the way is clear and the vehicle has been brought to a full stop? And the answer is from a one-way street into a one when the way is clear and the vehicle has brought to a full stop? When a blowout occurs you should. Number 1. Let up on the accelerator and concentrate on steering. Number 2. Accelerate and steer to the left. Number 3. Accelerate and steer to the right. Number 4. Let up on the accelerator and jam on the brakes. And the answer is let up on the accelerator and concentrate on steering. In what lane of traffic should you drive when you intend to make a right-hand turn? Number 1. Close to the left side of the roadway. Number 2. Close to the right-hand side of the roadway. Number 3. Close center line of the roadway. Number 4 does not matter provided you signal. And the answer is close to the right-hand side of the roadway. Under which of the following conditions is the road likely to be most slippery? Number 1 after it has rained for several hours. Number 2 for the first few minutes after it starts for rain or following a light drizzle. Number 3 when center line markings have just been painted. Number 4. When the highway is new and first used by the public? And the answer is for the first few minutes after it starts for rain or following a light drizzle? While driving around curve a good practice is to Number 1. Ride in the center of the road? Number 2. Enter the curve at a steady speed and apply brakes if needed? Number 3. Slow down when entering curve only when pavement is slippery? Number 4. Enter curve slowly and increase speed as the driver gets the feel of the curve. And the answer is enter curve slowly and increase speed as the driver gets the feel of the curve. When a license is reinstated after 15 point suspension the point total. Number 1 is reduced to 7. Number 2 is reduced to 9. Number 3 remains the same. Number 4 is deleted from record? And the answer is is reduced to 7? When does the law require lights on vehicles to be turned on? Number 1 between dusk and dawn and at any other time you cannot see clearly for a distance of 150 meters, 500 feet? Number 2 between one half hour before sunset to one half hour after sunrise and at any other time you cannot see clearly for a distance of 150 meters? 500 feet? Number 3 between sunset and sunrise? Number 4 no specified time? 
and the answer is between one half hour before sunset to one half hour after sunrise and at any other time you cannot see clearly for a distance of 150 meters, 500 feet? When two cars reach an uncontrolled intersection at approximately the same time, the right of way should be given to Number 1 The one moving faster Number 2 Neither one Number 3 The one approaching from the right Number 4 The one approaching from the left And the answer is the one approaching from the right What must a driver do before entering a highway from a private road or driveway? Number 1 Sound horn and proceed with caution Number 2 Enter or cross the highway as quickly as possible Number 3 Yield right of way to all vehicles approaching on the highway Number 4 Give hand signal then take right of way And the answer is yield right of way to all vehicles approaching on the highway it is more dangerous to drive at the maximum speed limit at night than during daytime because Number 1 The roadways are more apt to be slippery at night Number 2 You cannot see as far as ahead at night Number 3 Your reaction time is slower at night Number 4 Some drivers unlawfully drive with parking lights only And the answer is you cannot see as far as ahead at night When entering a highway, what must drivers do? Number 1 Signal, increase speed and merge smoothly with traffic. Number 2 Drive slowly and be prepared to stop for freeway traffic. Number 3 Stop on the acceleration lane, wait for an opening, and then enter the freeway rapidly. Number 4 Slow down, then enter the freeway at a sharp angle. And the answer is Signal, increase speed, and merge smoothly with traffic. When must drivers stop for school buses on roads with a median? Number 1. Every time the bus stops. Number 2. There is no need to stop on roads with a median. Number 3. When behind a stopped bus which has its upper red lights flashing. Number 4. Upon every approach to a school bus. And the answer is when behind a stopped bus which has its upper red lights flashing. When a streetcar is stopped to take on or discharge passengers where there is no safety zone, what does the law require drivers to do before passing the streetcar? Number 1. Pass on the left side when the way is clear. Number 2. Stop behind the rear of the streetcar, then proceed with caution. Number 3. Stop at least 2 meters behind the rear doors where passengers are getting on or off. Number 4. Sound horn and pass with caution. And the answer is stop at least 2 meters behind the rear doors where passengers are getting on or off. Thanks for visiting my channel. Please subscribe like and share your experience in comment I read your comments regular.